Every Sunday is a little Easter. Jesus rose from the grave on the first day of the week, and so now every first day of the week is, is a time to remember his victory over death. Now we have the one big Easter Sunday every year after the season of Lent. Uh, we do that usually in the spring. Uh, but every single Sunday is really an Easter Sunday. And so if you only come to church on Easter Sunday, uh, good news, uh, every Sunday is a chance to come to church and rejoice in Jesus' victory over death. Now this coming Sunday is a little Easter, but it is a huge little Easter. Uh, the Old Testament reading is about the, uh, the raising to life uh, of the widow's son at Zarephath. And the gospel reading is uh, about the raising to life of the widow's son at the town of Nain. We have Jesus' victory over death on display for us uh, here at the end of September uh, in the beginning of, the, of fall. Uh, it's a huge little Easter Sunday that we have. And as we look at Jesus' victory over death, uh, we see that uh, through that message, you know, the Holy Spirit uh, creates in us perseverance. Uh, it, it is worth persevering in this uh, life where, where that we call the, the valley of the shadow of death, the veil of tears. It is worth persevering you know, through all of this uh, because though this world is so marked by death, uh, and this year is so marked by death, where we are just inundated with statistics about death again and again. We can still persevere. Because Jesus has conquered death. Death has been swallowed up in victory. The prophet lies down on the, the widow's son uh, and prays to God and he is brought to life. Jesus stops the coffin and says to the little boy, get up. And he gets up and he gives him back to his mother. Death doesn't get to win because Jesus, the son of God, who died on the cross, was buried, he rose on the third day. Jesus lives and the victories won and so we can persevere flowing from, from that wonderful message. Well, this coming Sunday, uh, we're going to have a, a service outside. Uh, we're going to have that service at 9 o'clock. Uh, and uh, we invite you to, to come and uh, to uh, rejoice with us uh, on this huge little Easter Sunday where we get to sing some great Easter hymns together uh, in the beautiful fall weather. Uh, I pray that you get to join us uh, this Sunday, uh, September 27th at 9 a.m. God be with you today.